Hi, I'm Rassi, and here's some jumps I found at Soldier 76 on Hanamura. I'll be utilizing the mechanics of sprinting midair and grenade jumping today to make some of these jumps possible. So this vantage spot's pretty good. A lot of snipers can get up there, and I really can't with normal movement means. I can jump and sprint all I want, but I'm not going to get up there, as you can see. Now, if I do a simple grenade jump, I can get up there, and that'll enable me to get a great vantage sight, put some damage out on that window, and heal people around there, which is pretty good. I'm also able to, with a more advanced jump, jump to their bridge and get out of there and maybe chase some targets, do whatever I need to do. I'm also able to jump back. Getting on top of the here is a clear vantage point for Soldier 76. And he's able to do a lot of things here, like look at the point. And with a, and with a quick series of sprint jumps, he's able to get on top of this perch as well. And look around at the yard and the side areas here. However, you can't really shoot at the tree, so there's that. Utilizing a vertical grenade jump with a sprint at the end will let you get up to here. This enables you a good lookout position on this yard. You're also able to jump to this balcony. However, if you want to just go to the balcony, you're able to make this jump as well, but it's very difficult. You're also able to get onto that perch from these rocks. However, as much as it looks like, you cannot sprint jump on there. You will have to jump up the rocks and do a small grenade jump. Being able to get into this window is pretty useful, and there are several ways that you can do this. One, you can lay down a health station and do a, a small grenade jump into the window. Pretty trivial. No real challenge. However, you are also able to sprint jump with the proper angle right into the window, taking no damage and losing no cooldowns. You can also do this on the other side. If you find yourself in the lower section of last and you want to get out quickly, you're able to jump onto this pillar with a grenade jump and then simply sprint jump onto the bridge. Clearly, as you're able to do that on that pillar, you can jump on here and have kind of a perch spot. This upcoming jump is a good indicator of the maximum jump height that you can do for a grenade jump. This grenade jump from the staircase out to the yard seems impossible, but you're able to just barely clear it. It's very challenging and took me many tries. One factor that makes this and other jumps appear to be pretty challenging is that the game seems like it's trying to do all of its physics and moment and thusly momentum calculations server side, and this makes there seem to be a perceptible delay in between shooting your, your grenade um, and it actually pushing you somewhere, making the timing for jumps pretty challenging. Everything should be possible at any ping, but it's definitely it definitely feels pretty bad. So that's something to keep in mind when attempting these jumps. Thank you, and hopefully the video was informative, and perhaps uh, I'll be making more of these in the future if people are interested. I just thought this was an interesting mechanic to talk about since I haven't really heard anyone say anything. Feel free to respond back to me with any questions. A good place to catch me is uh, generally Steam. Um, I will also also be attempting to stream on Twitch now that the Overwatch beta is back, so you can check me out there as well. All right. Thank you, guys.